Hello and welcome everyone. Today's video features the brand new Pier 10 French Heavy Cruiser Brennus. Now Brennus has just been announced as going to be available for research points in the research bureau. We don't have the exact number as of yet, but Brennus there's seven of these 305 millimeter main battery guns in two twin mounted turrets, four and one triple mounted turret aft. Now, Brennus is described in game as a super heavy cruiser, year of design 1956, similar to the Henri the Fourth class. The main difference from the prototype is seven 305 millimeter main guns and reinforced torpedo armament. So let's take a quick look at the Brennus. As stated, it's going to be the new research bureau ship. So we'll start by looking at the armor layout is four end plating lower and upper of 25 millimeters the main deck armor is 30 the casemate is 30 superstructure 18 and here the aft end plating lower and upper both 25 millimeters there seems to be a tiny little bug with the armor viewer here we can see the Main armor belt is 140 millimeter and a lower section of 105 and that runs the full for some reason off it also turns off the belt armor so there's a little little bug in the armor viewer here at the moment so 140 millimeters and a lower section of 105 the main battery gun turrets Frontal plate, 305, 270, 150, all 150 there on the top. Rear plating of 270. We'll have a look at the Citadel itself. Mostly submerged, slightly small raised section running from the front turret to just underneath. The rear turret deck armor 80 millimeters a twire chip 140 and 100 the same 160 and 110 on the bow and there is the citadel this ties in directly to the hit points 57,800 hit points with a 19% torpedo protection damage reduction is boosted by having survivability expert an extra four and a half thousand HP. This is what I'm currently testing at the moment. Upgrades I'm using. In terms of consumables, repair party is survivability is augmented by having four repair parties. And a very nice speed boost. 20% speed boost. Now let's take a look at these main battery guns. You get two twin mounted 305 millimeter turrets here for. Now these have a 11.9 second reload. They can rotate 180 degrees in 30 seconds. They have a max dispersion of 161 meters. And a firing range of 20.3 kilometers. An additional triple mounted 305, the exact same ballistics. These seven 305 millimeter guns can fire both high explosive and armor piercing. The high explosive has a max damage of 4,250, 27% fire chance. They can pen 51 millimeters of armor and have quite a nice shell speed. Of 905 meters per second the armor piercing slightly slower very good AP max damage 8700 damage with a shell speed of 870 meters per second Brennus also comes armed with secondary battery in the form of 12 127 millimeter guns in six twin mounted turrets can see them here three on each side so 12 127 millimeter 
They have a reload time of 3.6 seconds, firing high explosive shells. They have a base range of 8.7 kilometers, firing high explosive, 1800 max damage, 10% fire chance. They can pen 21 millimeters of armor with a shell speed of 808 meters per second. Now, as already stated, Brennus gets reinforced torpedo armament in the form of four triple mounted 550 millimeter torpedo launchers. So 12 torpedoes in total, two X3 launchers on each side. Quite nasty. These have a reload time of 90 seconds, a firing range of nine kilometers. They can inflict a max damage of 14,833. Torpedo speed of 60 knots with a detectability range of just 1.3 kilometers. So quite nasty torpedoes. In terms of airstrike, you do get access to the depth charge airstrike with an operational range of 8 kilometers. These have a reload time of 30 seconds with two available flights. One aircraft for attacking flight, dropping two bombs with max damage of 4,900. In terms of AA defense, Brennus gets a rating of 70. Now this consists of five single mounted 20 millimeter Orlicons. You can see them here mounted primarily here on the superstructure. 5 20 mm 8 quad mounted 40 mm Bofors familiar main AA gun 40 mm Bofors so 32 of those in total this is augmented by having the secondary battery act as dual purpose the 6 twin mounted 127 mm secondary battery guns now, all combined, they pump out a continuous average damage of 238, the majority of which you can see here from the in-game values, the majority is medium range. Brennus can fire five shell explosions per flak salvo with a max damage of 1680, priority sector reinforcement of 50% and the max firing range of these AA guns is six kilometers. In terms of maneuverability, here base speed is 35 knots, further augmented by Sierra Mike, and a 20% engine boost. So the base speed is 36.8, allowing you to get well over 40 knots in straight line speed when engine boost is active. Turning circle radius, 840 meters, and a rudder shift time of 9 seconds. So finally, stats-wise, concealment rating of 55, which means a detectability range by enemy ships at 13 kilometers. You will be detected by enemy submarines and aircraft at 6.7 kilometers. So this is the Brennus. The brand new tier 10 French heavy cruiser that is currently in testing on the PTS server at the moment. It has been announced that it will be available when out of testing, of course, for research points in the research bureau. So I hope you enjoyed this little preview guide of the Brennus. If you liked the video, feel free to hit that thumbs up and subscribe. So you don't miss on future announcements and videos so if you'd like to see some live gameplay feel free to come over and visit me on twitch you can see the link here on screen i look forward to seeing you all